Hey everyone, welcome to another traveling solo log. Yes, it's a solo. So right now I got a special treat for you. So actually right now I'm visiting Erdogol's Gazi's grave. So this is where the tomb where he's buried actually. So I'm right now in Sogo, Turkey. So come with me, let's check out the area because I know if you're a big fan of the TV series, which I am, and I know many of my friends are too. So I wanna just show you how it is, show you where he's buried because this guy is very famous. If you don't know who he is, he's actually the guy who laid the foundation for the Ottoman Empire. So his son was Osman, and Osman was the first sultan of the Ottoman Empire. So this man, Ertugul, uh, Ertugul Ghazi, actually is the guy who laid the foundation. And Ghazi just means veteran. So his name is Ertugul, and then at the end they leave a title just to show you like the significance for him. So it shows like he's a veteran, and he's well known in world history, and also just well known in Ottoman history. Because this guy basically is the one who started this whole Ottoman Empire, which is awesome. So let's go straight and just show you around this area real quick. So the building straight ahead is where he's buried. You can see they have a plaque that says Erdogan Ghazi. Let me just see, before we enter this beautiful garden, let me show you, you can take a picture over here too. That's cool. So if you want to dress as an old, like, like back in the olden days in the Ottoman Empire, you can, cool pictures. You see over here, you could, uh, Wash your hands with water. It has some Arabic over here, you can see. So let me go inside right now. Many people come from all over the world, all over Turkey, just to see this guy's grave, which is impressive. So this is where he's buried actually. But before I go and show you his beautiful place where he's buried, let me just show you the outside. Beautiful garden. And actually each place where you see flowers, someone's buried there. So let me just show you some like notable people. So all these people that are buried here should have been part of his tribe or should have been part of his family. And these are the, the people that lay the foundation for Turkey or for the Ottoman Empire. So please hit that like button because I know you guys love Ertigal. The series is amazing. Gundas Bay, so a lot of them have at the end of their name Bay or Alp, that just means like, just each uh, ending like of the name has a special meaning, like veteran or someone else like this, like Ghazi. Like this is Abdurrahman Ghazi. So if you watch the TV show, you probably know some of these people. See this guy, Alp, at the end of his name. Saltor. Samsa. Oh, Samsa, he's awesome. We got Cardassi, Dundar Bay. You see, Bay at the end. Check it out, this is the whole garden area. It's beautiful. And how they maintain it, it's very well kept. It was only about like, two and a half to three hour drive from Istanbul, Turkey. So if you're in Istanbul and want to see a great notable figure in the history of the Ottoman Empire, even in the world, come over here, it's well worth it. And also if you love the Erdogan TV series, why not? You'll see many of the people that are actually in the TV series buried here. So this is how it looks like in this angle. And now I'm just gonna show you where he's actually buried. And what's cool is actually where he's buried, it shows you his tribe's flag, the Kai tribe, if you guys don't know. So he actually came from, the Kai tribe actually came from Central Asia. So they actually migrated to this land, which is interesting to know, because actually some Turks, you actually might see them, they actually look uh, kind of Asian, believe it or not. So unfortunately, we can't go inside of the building because of COVID-19. I know, I'm sorry. This building right here, can't go inside. Because you see it has something that says COVID-19, so we cannot go inside. But, but we can't see from the window. Check it out. So this is from the window. So you can see on the left is a blue flag, which represents uh, his tribe. And then on the right is the Turkish flag, 
and you can see actually on top of his grave or you'd say tomb that has a hat that looks like a turban usually they put the turbans on people who are very notable figures in in ottoman history and then you can see also uh there's a cloth a green cloth that's all wrapped around his tomb with nice decorations and you can see this a well-kept area where they put his grave just out of respect is this man died over 500 years ago and check out the room where he's inside this is the beautiful room if there wasn't COVID-19 I'd be allowed in but eh, there is so okay awesome so this is the room over here this is Erdogan so yeah I hope you guys enjoyed the video I sure did and I'm just going to be right now walking around this area, checking out more of this beautiful area. So good. And here, let me show you. What are the shows here? Uglu Osman Ghazi. So this is what the Kai Alps would be wearing actually back then. So it's amazing. They're wearing the clothes from like Erdogan's time. So they're called Kai Alps, which Alps just means knights. And knights, you know, are just elite warriors. So it's very nice. You see. And you can actually take a picture with them, which I did. Amazing. So Erdogan is a very famous guy. So please give Erdogan a like. Please give me a like and also subscribe if you haven't already. I really appreciate it. And also I'm just happy to be here and enjoy nice weather. Let's see up there, nice weather. So as always, take care and I'll catch you on the next one. Peace.